Welcome to another episode of Pop Culture Unboxing, and today we have a special edition of unboxing as the long-awaited post-Christmas haul um, unboxing. Uh, this wasn't really my fault. This was more of right stuff didn't ship this until last week. It came today. Right, if I had DVDs, I already didn't get shipped till last week, and uh, it didn't arrive till like Tuesday or Wednesday. I forget. This it got today because FedEx screwed up badly for those of now. But <laughs> we're gonna oh, be open. It. We're gonna be, take a look at opening uh, stuff that I got from Right Stuff Amazon and uh, and Ring of Honor Wrestling. Uh, but first things first. I do wanna. <laughs> I don't want to tell a little story about this. I told this on cast recently. It's on one of the videos. This is um, complete a set uh, other than the chases and I think Super Sailor Moon is the only one I'm missing really from the from the from the this is actually the show series one was really series it's like a series two. I don't know. But this is Queen Barrel from the Sailor Moon Funko uh, Pop series. Um, this was a Toys R Us exclusive. This was actually a Christmas present from my mom. It didn't come, didn't get here until, um, I think, um, when, uh, a couple of days ago. And, uh, what happened is, they, they attempted, for some reason, the postal service decided to attempt, attempt to desert, deliver this to Jamaica, New York. Don't ask me why. I don't know, but I had to call Amazon. They fixed it, and they they called uh, the USPS, the Postal Service, and they said it to the right. They said it here. Um, it took a few days for it to. Doesn't really matter that one either. So yeah. So that finally came. Uh, thank God. Um, another one, this is really to complete a meta set. Other than, uh, there's one other one. It's a chase of this. It's sort of like the. This is Negaduck from Darkwing Duck. Comic story I had this. That's all magic of the spell from my uh, DuckTales. Might pick up somewhere down the line. Definitely cool. Definitely glad to pick that up. Um, what I've been wanting to pick up, I saw they made that one. As a previous exclusive, you only get that at like comic book stores. Um, or it's a preview. It's a sort of like a specialty shop sort of thing too. But uh, so glad they've gotten that. I'm not going to go through description of everything because I would be here like for an hour or more. Um, next we have the remake of It. I actually just picked this up on Wednesday, on Thursday, excuse me. I have to go to the house, start with BJ's. I wanted to see that, didn't get to see that. It was in movies. Um, this is 4K because I got 4K TV. This includes... Uh, both content includes uh, Paywise Lives, The Loser Club, Author of Fear, and Delayed Scenes. Cool. So I want something to talk about instead of just sitting there waiting uh, on me to open it. Now, um, one thing I do have to mention, and this is not the complete. Or there's one thing missing, Attack on Titan Season 2. Unfortunately, that's a pre-order, so it'll come next month. We have some postcards. Sailor Moon Super S Part 1, coming this spring, limited edition Blu-ray. And DVD, episodes 127 and 146, uncut remastered. So, probably the worst of the seasons. Anime. 
Yeah, we're trying to make it more kid friendly and more for, for kids because they always grow up. And it just did not work. Um, then we have Visit Japan Travel Among Friends. Advertisement for this. Wish I had the money for it. This costs a lot of money. I've heard for what I've heard. Um, I actually thought about going on one of these one time. I almost was going to, but decided not to. So, so are these things. The Anime Spring, the world's best rated J Japan tour for anime fans. Shop Akihabara Otak Otaka Road. Another Otaku's enclaves. See the cherry blossoms, explore Kyoto, and much more. Ski and swim, experience. <sighs> Sorry. Something fell, I should know. Well, it's new. Uh, Skate and swim, experience the seas where Yuri on ice and free take place. Stay in traditional inns in Tortoise City featured in an anime or a ceiling strung bullet train right across Japan. Summer fireworks, festival lights on this fan centric tour of to Tokyo, Kyoto, Osaka, Kobe, and Kanazawa, complete with a stay in a traditional hot spring. If I ever had the money, and the courage to do that. <laughs> um, this is something I picked up a couple of weeks ago. I think maybe last week. Um, card cap to Sakura, the clear card, volume one. The anime recently started. The sample cast double start. Um, uh, like I think two days before my birthday. On the 25th, I think 23rd, on Funimation.com, but I think at least, I think the first episode's up on uh, Crunchyroll. Oh, link is I can read the back. And there's so much stuff here I want to go through it. There's not enough time to read through everything. We have to go for hours. Okay, now we're going to go through the uh, right stuff, uh, stuff here. Um... First is we have the Professor Layton anime, Professor Layton and the Eternal Diva. It's by by the hit games on Nintendo DS. I've never played this. I've played a little bit of uh, Professor Layton versus Phoenix Wright, which is pretty good. Um, but I've heard good things about it. It's sort of a mystery. Sort of. Show. I mean, game and series. This is. Supposed to be pretty good. I'm gonna pick it, pick this one up a while now. So next, another one I'm gonna pick up. This just came out. This is the first one. No, okay, it's not. It. This is okay. Sorry, I wanted to. Make sure we do this in the right order. Shit. And what the hell? Mm. <sighs> Okay. I'm trying to make sure I put this right over. For um, we have, and this was again. This is part of the end of their sale that was going on. Um, every Christmas they do. They have every holiday season from uh, right like right after Thanksgiving till Christmas. They have uh, uh sale offers. A lot of the stuff will. Some of them are for one week, uh, some are for one day, but a lot of them are for the whole month. And one of the things was they had a bundle for the first three Digimon Tri movies. Reunion, Determination, and uh, Confession. 
And I got all three. Been meaning to pick these up. Um, I have not seen it. Of course, saw the advertisement anime for the fourth one. Definitely looking forward to looking at more of these. Interesting fact, this little copy expires in the 16th or 8th this year. That's weird. It's a weird thing. And it'll look at Spire. Yeah, this one inspires the 7th, 5th, 2018, the, the third one. Huh. Strange. I'm telling you, what's a television jiggle? Eh. I don't know. Probably grand seven. Next, we have one. I'd forgotten this had come out on DVD. I don't know, I didn't know but this is. Blue Exorcist, the Kyoto Saga, uh, the first volume, includes, I think, the first six episodes. Um, I got this, yeah, it does include the first six episodes, because, um, uh, Bryce, uh, the two main voice actors are going to be it. Uh, anyway, next, going to Bryce to Bryce, uh, Pen but the book, gets, I think that's how you say his name. Yeah, it's getting real over hard because of the dark background. Sheesh. Boom. Alright. Don't follow me, don't be following. There's that. Definitely excited to see that. I love the first dub uh, of Black Exorcist show. I've actually, I watched it twice. I watched the English dub and, uh, Oh, no, what's the sub complete before it was, you know, dub and then I the rest of it. And, uh, what's up, Toonami? Next, we have, um, this is the complete, my collection. Is, I, I thought I got this one, and I didn't. It is Google, Google 13, the collection 2. This is cause episode 14 to 26. Um... Uh, video a while back we showed that I got three and four and I had one way before this. I've forgotten to get volume two. This, uh, this, this was one that just, this is really I just, I needed a filler for, for, if I wanted to get what I wanted to order. And this was sort of a filler or filler order piece. Uh, more than anything. Is Ichi Ichi the the killer episode zero? This is actually an anime prequel to live action movie of the same name. And show how old this is. It's actually by Central Park Media. Just showing it's just right. It's just in the back. Which have not been in not not been uh, releasing anime for several years. And the last one from the right stuff box, that the last one overall, is The Gray Man Season 3 Part 2. I've been looking forward to watching this. That's, uh. I don't even know when I watch. first half of it was like you know a month ago like two months ago but definitely definitely one of my favorite anime of recent times good show really good show so yeah that was the right stuff it was all right it's done the show on the receipt But 
<laughs> was a faith bar so I to get his last stuff early. I want to get in the uh, right stuff. There is that. Next, let's show off um, what's in here. I put it in here uh, because what happened is with the Ring of Honor box is the box they left out in the war. It got, it was, it's been raining, it's been not raining, it's been, well, it's raining now, it's been raining the last couple of days, but it's not been like raining, raining like for that. But, um, what happened, uh, what happened is snow started milk is a little bit warmer, so they were, uh, So they left it. So I put it in this because it fits. And what the funny thing is, I should have taken a photo of it and that, with the with the uh, with the with the Amazon box. If the Amazon had like four DVDs in it, and the box, four DVDs in in my uh, where did I put it? in the uh, splitter for uh, for casting. Well, it came in a huge box, like about this size, but it's like more, like, if you put it, if it was this width, but this length, you know, you know what I'm saying, I mean, but it's tall, but this width, and the box had this amount of stuff in it. The rest of it was air. Where's air cushions? <laughs> I, I, I can't make this stuff up. It's it's been weird, weird month. Uh, uh, well, let's show some other stuff off I got before we get into the Amazon stuff. Um, at the comic book store recently, training day. Ethan Hawke in the uh, that's all Washington. I've never things about. I've never actually seen this movie. Good, good, good. And we have Wedding Crashers. Again, another movie we got cheap was used, but again, I haven't seen it. And the uh, cop, the record store is always good with used DVDs, so good. And then we have, again, another one I've never seen. Seen is like you know what? Three bucks, might as well try. Can't hurt. The natural. Don't remember, probably remembered. I I just was like, I mentioned I like cast like during the whole week kit and only Wednesday casters and I'm like, because I almost look like I hit the lights. So There's gonna be the natural moment. <laughs> so yeah, like, oh, I might as well try it. Pick it, get it, and try it. Three bucks, so didn't really hurt. The last thing, it, last thing from uh, recent uh, DVD uh, used DVD uh, pickups is um, Finding Nemo. Yeah, I've never seen this one either. Finding Dory's on Netflix. So, you know, I said, you know, what? three bucks. I'll try this, and maybe I'll try D Finding Dory if I like this one. Both are both really good. So next, we're gonna go. Uh, this is the Amazon. The, on Amazon, first is we got the splitter for the uh, HDMI splitter. I haven't tried it, but hopefully it works. So I got. Is it? PS3, they can stream PS3 games, hopefully. Next we have uh, Roni Kenshin Part 3, The Legend Ends. This is the live action movie. Live action Roni Kenshin movies. These are these have been really good. Can we see uh, how much it differs from the anime ending? The anime ending was... It just, you should have ignored the, the OVA ending and just try to remember, just, just try to... <laughs> Just try to like remember that the the, uh, the TV show ending is probably the bad one. The the, the the TV 
Yummy ending is just nonsensical. Or, or Kenshin gets some disease and goes home to die and like gives it to his wife gives it to his wife and it's horrible. It just I, I don't know why you went that way. I, I, I don't know. It's like, oh, we can't get this guy, character a happy ending. I heard it's very different from the way the manga ends. Because I have not read the complete manga. I've been, that's one thing I want to get one of these days is the complete manga. Uh, next we have one I've been really been looking forward to getting. It is the Squid Girl Complete Series. I have already season one. But to get season two, you needed to get the complete collection. Blame Sentai Films, I didn't want to make this one up. But we have Squid Girl, the complete collection, which includes season one and season two, and the OVA, which had never been released here. I've been really looking forward to watching this. Definitely awesome show. This was a really, season one was really funny. And uh, season two had never been released here. And, uh, other than on Crunchyroll, uh, Media Blasters had the rights to it, uh, but never released it on DVD. Next, we have Naru Rise of the Yokai Clan. Now, this, this is what, this one was a little weird, this one was a little weird situation. This one, the next one, is they, uh, Viz had released these a few years ago on Blu ray and DVD. The thing was, is they had, um, done, uh, that sh they had done, um, Neon Alley, and I just got to watch them on there, on there. Well, Neon Alley came and went, they, they closed it down, I never watched these two shows on there. On Neon Alley, by the time Neon Alley was gone. So I was sort of left out, I was like, I'll eventually get them, I never have, and I was like, you know what? It's about time I picked these two up. First, like I said, first we have Nero, uh, uh, the OK Clan. Season two is actually on Netflix. Season one is not for some reason. Don't ask me why. I'm not the Netflix people. Gonna ask people at Netflix. And we have the other one, a Soul World. This one is not on Netflix. I I was a little bit tentative to get this one because the main character is sort of weird and sort of nerdy, geeky, fat, and uh, it's like, I don't really want to watch so pretty much about me. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but, yeah. That was good. And that was the, that was the Amazon. Or right, now, to the ring of other stuff. And this is a lot of stuff. Uh, this was from this is this is the fish catching up. This is code stuff from 2013 to 2016. This completes actually everything I have that's still available from Ring of Honor uh, on DVD. Um, it comes to every uh, uh, except for the collections, which again most of the stuff is like stuff that's on DVD, except for like ones that are on television. And it's like. Yeah, you know, I may pick up some of that, but we'll see. Sometime. So... This was, I think I just picked the collections, the shows were more important. To finish getting in, I, I'm glad I did. First we have Road to the Greatness, this was uh, part of, or actually tournament of the uh, Road to the Title Tournament uh, Finals. Including Kevin Steen and Michael Elgin versus Aaron Cole and uh, Tommaso Ciampa. This doesn't feature any talent tournament matches, but this was like, this was on like the road to the talent matches. Just the, the finals, but you know, kind of the champion after Jay Briscoe, the, uh, uh, give it the 
Well, good injury. Next, we have night two of this featuring Adam Cole versus Ron Strong in the Ringmaster Challenge. Proving Ground Instant Award featuring Red Dragon versus CNC Wrestle Factory of Caprice Coleman and uh, Sergio Alexander. Trail and Rush in Abel Attitude. Dave Richards versus Mike Bennett. Michael Bennett, aka Mike, Mike Canola. Then, nag. What the hell? Sorry. <laughs> right, I think uh, I would have the stuff out. Next, we have Wrestling's Finest from January 25th. This is actually my birthday. Pittsburgh, PA. Jake Emma Cole versus Inmate Man Hardy versus Michael and Chris Hero versus the Briscoes. The top prospect tournament finals for 2014. Yeah, my birthday, day 25th. I don't say what age. Oh, well, I think it does. Hopefully it does. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Next we have State of the Art. From February 8, 2014. Featuring uh, Jay Briscoe versus the M. Cole with Briscoe's real world title on the line. That's when that, because Jay never left the belt, he was like, calling himself the world world champion. Of his own belt. So. <laughs> There's that. Next, we have Raising the Bar Night 1, featuring Jay Lethal versus Silas Young, Adam Cole versus Matt Taven. We have Night 2 of Raising the Bar with the Ringmaster Challenge of Adam Cole versus Chris Hero. And so much we're gonna be here for we we'll would be here for longer we're gonna be here. Oh yeah, but twenty oh it's a half hour in the right. We have Road to Best in the World twenty fourteen, night one from June 6, 2014, from Carbondale, Illinois. The TV title and the world title, excuse me, world title with a versus the winner of a six man scramble. There's it. Night 2 featuring the Red Dragon versus the Briscoes for Tag Tales, M. Cole versus the Monster Champa. We have Road the Best in the World from Fe from Friday 29. May 29th, 2015. <laughs> oh, this is this is from the 2015 one. Okay, we were 2015. Adam Cole vs. Roderick Strong, The Kingdom vs. War Machine. This is from uh, San Antonio, Texas. Then we have Night 2. Uh, from Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, facing Jay Briscoe versus the winner of a triple threat match, and Jay Lethal versus the winner of another triple threat match.
And we have May 3 at Best Road to Best of World from Collinsville, Illinois. For Jay Briscoe, for Roderick Strong, for Michael Elgin and uh, Moose. Jay Lethal versus Raven Rowe. Dixon versus Matt Seidel and Delirious. We have R.H. Reloaded Tour from August 29, 2015 from Atlanta, Georgia featuring Red Dragon and M. Cole versus the J. Lethal and the Addiction. Is that bitch? It's a, get too much. And we have uh, Night 2 from Chicago Ridge, Illinois, featuring uh, Future Shock and Ram Cole Cairoli versus The Young Bucks, The Lethal versus Moose. M Night 3 from California, PA. Featuring the Briscoes vs. The Addiction, Rock Strong vs. Michael Elgin. Next, we have Glory by Honor uh, from from October 24, 2015. I think I'm night one. Is this night two? Oh, this is night one. Okay, this is only, this is one on Wednesday at night one, only one night. Freezes. It's their annual champions versus all stars. It's the RH World Champion, the Lethal, the Rock, TV Champ, Rock Strong, and the Kingdom Tag Team Champions versus Moose, Dalton Castle, and the Addiction. AJ Styles in, 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 doing an interview. I think he had his back was hurt. That's why he was a part of the show. Wrestling. Might have been scheduled to be in that main event, but was pulled because, uh, again, it's back. They have Winter Warriors Tour 2016 from Indiana State Fairgrounds, Indianapolis, Indiana, February, excuse me, Friday, January 15th, 2016. Featuring the Young Bucks in the All Night Express versus the Briscoes and War Machine. Rock Strong versus Curry Man. Have one of Warriors Tour Night Two from Duluth, Georgia, featuring all champions of all line and champions versus the Bull Club, with Jay Lethal, War Machine, and Rock Strong all defending their titles against the Young Bucks, Carl Anderson, Doc Gallows, and Luke Gales. We have uh, the Irish 14th anniversary show from fr Friday, February 26, 2016. Featuring Jay Lethal versus Kyle Rowley versus Adam Cole. Armstein versus the All Night Express, no DQ for the Tag Tales. Bullet Club versus ACH, Brad Sidel, Kushida for the Young Fun Away Six Man Tag Team Championship. Um. Okada versus Moose. Briscoes versus Michael Long and uh, Hiroshi Tanahashi. Uh, Dalton Castle versus Hiroki Goto. Book Club was uh, K Mega Young Bucks. There we go. Next we have Super Car Super Carnival and Night One. Now I have Night One, Night Two of this already. We have Night One because I couldn't afford it. But we have most of you guys versus Young Bucks during their TNA feud. Jay Lethal versus Rio Leo Rush.
we have Congress Tour from Saturday, April 25th, 2015 from Hopkins, Minnesota. Jay Lethal vs. Kyle O'Reilly. Briscoe Brothers vs. War Machine. And this is what I saw part of it. I, um, I think I saw all of it, but what happened, <laughs> what happened is, end up happening is, this is one of the ones I ordered on pay-per-view when I was on, uh, because it was a pay-per-view and, uh, I think I saw, yeah, I think I probably missed, like, maybe one, but, yeah, you know, I think it, it came in the night though, O'Reilly match, because I forget which one, I think it was the one I, like, I forgot I had ordered after ordering it. Seeing Ishii vs. Bobby Fish for the TV title. 8 man tag, Kushida, Moses Machine Guns, Matt Idell vs. Bull Club, Young Bucks and Grills of Destiny. Jay Lethal vs. Colt Cabana. Kyle Riley vs. Tetsuya Naito. Orsheen vs. The Briscoes. The Addiction vs. Cheeseburger and Jason Liger. I was just going to show, show Adam Cole joined the book club. Let's see how wire spoil, spoilers. And we have Reloaded Tour September 17, 2016 from Lockport, New York. That much against the Honor Rumble for the title shot. And against Jalen says he challenges Adam Cole. I guess he wins. I don't know. together. <laughs> Extra of Glory by Honor uh, 15 from October 14, 2016 from Chicago Ridge, uh, Illinois featuring Am Cole and Hangman Page versus Red Dragon Jay Little vs. Matt Jackson Mark vs. vs. Cold Cabana Super Heavyweight Triple Threat <laughs> We have Champions vs. All-Stars. I have two of Glory Rayana. Between Cole Fish and the Young Bucks vs. Briscoes and Dalton Castle Cole Cabana. Frank Gazzari vs. Jay Lethal. Now, the, the collection thing is, is, is a lot of, some of the stuff is out of print, so it's like, it's nice to be able to pick up some of the stuff. It's not that, when they, like I said, they do have, um, stuff on, uh, it's from television shows, which are not on DVD. The last two are Young Bucks, The Super Kick Party, Part 1 and Part 2. Yeah, this piece of a lot of stuff from like Earth TV, HD Net and stuff. So, stuff I have to print. I want to get it. Part one. It's part two. I think I actually got fired from our OH for a while. Blame Joe Barnett for that one. Yeah. Uh <laughs> total is about five hundred uh cost. And it was worth it because again it just was like take care of a lot of things I needed to take care of wanted to get and started to really catch up on the anime I've been meaning to catch up on for a while for a while because of I haven't because, you know, last year I've been I mean, next, you know. But yeah. That is going to be it for this unboxing video. There will be a look great coming this week. 
hopefully sometime uh, the next couple of days on, uh, excuse me, next week. I say this week. It's very Saturday. Oh, my brain's right. Uh, coming uh, in the next couple of days, it's already to the, heading to the post office. Hopefully, be have to be shipped on Monday. Hopefully, we'll see. Um, that's gonna be a string one. That's gonna be a watch. Um, also wait for her pack. Uh, the fur box. We're getting the mini one because they're not selling the major one anymore. And I even know those who. Yeah, not for this month. Um, but if you're even build it, they will ship it. Like. But uh, yeah. The new channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that follow button if you're watching on Twitch. Lots of good things coming up, including the Terran and Creed Origins, Kingdom Hearts, and lots more. Uh, let's play more reaction, more all kinds of good stuff coming here on the channel in the future. So also follow me on social media. Also, uh, uh, if also all kinds of referrals and all kinds of other stuff can be found if you want to help out this channel. All the links can be found in the description down below. So until next time, have a good one, everyone. Peace.